Hello my YouTube friend, this is Snow Mechanic here and today I want to show you how to check if your wiper motor is working. This one I got it out from the 2000 Toyota Tundra. This one is a 5 wire connector. I've seen a lot of videos with the 4 wire connector and they show perfect how to check it. But I did not see um, great videos on how to check a five wire connectors and the one I checked left me confused and baffled so what I did was I played with the wires myself and I found a way of how to check if your five wire wiper motor is working if you see right in, inside here right where the connector be at there are some numbers in there and you see it has five metals. This is the drawing I did. This is how it looks in there. This is the numbers it has. Like I said before, this is a five wire wiper motor. So I'm going to show you how to see if your wiper motor is working. You're gonna need a 12 volt battery and you're also going to need two wires like this and the first thing I did was as you can see I put a pair of pliers in the negative terminal now so what we're going to do is let me just show you in here so you can see what's going on this is the way it looks this is the orientation plus two BS plus one and E now B, BS I don't know what it's for and you see these blue parts, these are the metal pieces that are in there. So what we're going to do, we're going to check low speed. Low speed, we're going to go from E to plus 1. So that means we're going to go from here to here, and it's going to be low speed. From E to plus 2 is going to be high speed. From here to here. From plus 1 to plus 2 is reverse so the first one we're going to do is we're going to go from E to plus one we're going to connect one of the wires to the negative and this one we're going to put on E so the same way it is like that you can see so we know that E is over there. So we're going to connect this one right on E. It's connected on E. We're going to take this one and we're going to go to plus one. Remember, E to plus one is low speed. So we're going to go right next to it, plus one. That's the number that's in there. Plus one. Now that it's connected, we're going to turn it. We're going to take this cable and we're going to put it in the positive. And you're going to see this moving very slowly. That's the low speed. See it? So if you have problem with low speed, you check it. That's the way you're going to check it. Now we're going to do high speed. So high speed is from E to plus 2. So the, the red one is already at E. So we're going to take the black one and we're going to go to plus 2. That's right in the top, in the corner as you see. You put it in the metal piece in there. Okay. Now all we're going to do is now, I'm going to turn this. And that's going to be high speed from E to plus 2. There it goes. See how fast it's going? So if you have a problem with your high speed, that's the way you check it. Now we're going to do reverse. 
Reverse is from plus one to plus two. So we already got it connected at plus two because that's where we had it. Plus two is the top. So we're going to take the negative one and put it at plus one. It's in the bottom of it. You can see the bottom. Make sure the metals don't touch the other metals. That's why I have this plastic like this. So we're going to go to two. I got to make sure they don't touch. So there you go. It took me a little while because I didn't want the metals to be touching each other from the wires. So now that was plus one to plus two. And we should get reverse. And there we go. So if you have problem with the reverse, that's how you check it. So this is the way you check a, a fire wire wiper motor. This is from the Toyota. So once again, this is non mechanic. If you have any comments or questions, please post them down below or contact me on non mechanic101 at yahoo.com. That is non mechanic101 at yahoo.com. And remember, if non-mechanic can do it, you can do it. Later.